Guacamole, ladies. Brandy! I'm Brandy. And I'm Nadia. And we're here at Antojitos Authentic Mexican Food at Universal City Walk in the heart of Universal Orlando Resort. Which is a full service bar, restaurant, and entertainment venue. I am ready to be entertained. We're ready for your palate to be entertained. How about this guacamole? You talk about fresh? Let's, Let's eat. eat. Aesthetic is gorgeous. I know. You can pick the patio, you can put inside. <gasps> Brandy, is that table side guac? Yes, it is. Welcome to Antojitos. My name's Elliot. I'm your guacamole specialist here today. Hi, Elliot. Hi, ladies. So I'm going to go over my ingredients here. One, to make sure we don't have any allergies. Second, if there's anything you guys don't want in your guacamole, please advise. Mm. So we make it with fresh red tomatoes, red onions, garlic, green olives, cilantro, jalapeno, salt, lime, and olive oil. Completely customizable. Wonderful. Wow. He's a professional. The full show right in front of you guys. This, this doesn't get any better than this. It doesn't. Guacamole specialist. <laughs> this is how you know it's he's all been in doing the this. All of the wrists. Guacamole, ladies. The moment, moment of, of truth. truth. Hey, listen. Okay, Elliot. Okay. They don't call you a specialist okay. for nothing. This is so fresh. When you come, you have to get the guacamole. Yes. And you get have to. table side, all right? You have to. You? After us. Oh, yes. <laughs> and now it's time to enjoy some Mexican street tacos. Mm -hmm. Let's taco about it a little bit. All right. I like that. That's, that's cute. That's yeah. cute. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I have the beef barilla. Mm. I have beef. I have some cheese. I have some guajillo sauce. Guajillo. And then I have onions and cilantro. I have some cilantro rice because you know I love it. We and love some refried beans. I'm not mad at it. And I'm ready to try it. So I need you to tell me what you got so Yum. I can get into this. Ooh. If you're looking for a gluten free option, mm -hmm. the Al Pastor tacos are for you. So I have my pork, the onions, the cilantro with some pineapples on top. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. This meat is so tender and so moist. And I'm not a big beef person, but this is legit good. The sauce is the, the, the star of the show, okay? What do you have going on over there? The pork on this was cooked perfectly. It, it has such a, a nice light char on the outside, so it gives it a really good like crunch to it. And then the pineapples brandy just ties it all together with like this burst of sweet surprise goodness. I'm just in heaven right now. Nice. If you come here, you have to get tacos. I mean, you have to get tacos. They're, they're... Get tacos. You're welcome. What she said. So we have made our way over to the bar. Thank you so much. Where I have in front of me the grand margarita. And look how grand she looks, Brandy. Look, my glass is super unique. I'm telling it's so you, it's pretty. so cute. Yeah, and the taste is even better. I mean, the tamarindo really brings out such a, a pungent, sour taste. It's okay. equally balanced by the agave nectar sweetness. It's just a well-rounded drink altogether, and I'm loving it. And I have the mezcal old-fashioned. It's a mezcal liquor, but you have the filthy cherries at the bottom. Bottom that that adds a little smooth I love that. finish. Smooth finish. Shall we? We shall. Let's chill. Let's chill. So we have made it to our house specials, Brandy. I have my guisado, shrimp, chorizo, steak, and a little skillet. And then on the side, my rice, my flour, tortillas. I, I just want to mix on. and match and build and put everything together, Ooh, construct it in such what? a nice. You're a food architect. Call me Nadia, the food architect from now on. And call me, I'm with her. I like it. Okay, well, <laughs> I have the mar y tierra. Ooh. You got a little bit of sea, you got a little bit of land, you'll catch that later. I have some short ribs, I have shrimp, I have a tamale with a nice little sauce on the top, you know what I'm saying? Like some pickles, sauce. I don't know what this is, and I'm ready to eat it. And then I have the arroz con cilantro. What's gonna go on this now with my fork? Let's dig in. Uh, oh, so I got the burst of shrimp at first bite and it is cooked to perfection. Mm -hmm. And then I think I got a little sliver of the chorizo in there too. You don't have to look for the flavor. The flavor is right here. No search, no search, no search. Just, it's right here. It's all here. This meal, amazing. Perfect. I think it's time for dessert. I think you're right. Dessert 
dessert time. It's dessert time. I'm ready it's for dessert. The time we've been waiting for all day. All my life. <gasps> I am ready. The smell of this joke. Oh, oh, oh. You go first, go first. Mm. I'm just gonna take all this in. The chocolate on this. So I have the spicy chocolate crunch ice cream mm -hmm. coated mm -hmm. in chocolate cereal crunch. Coated. On the side, I have some churros. You know, if it wasn't sweet enough, add some more sweetness to it. Mm -hmm. Spicy mango salsa. Nice. And some passion fruit gel. Well, I'm gonna talk about this horchata tres leches. Mm. Okay, let's talk about what horchata is first. It is a drink where you have its white rice soaked in water, seasoned with cinnamon, and sweetened with sugar. Got some horchata, you have some vanilla cake, chocolate ganache, some fresh fruit, but the smell of this, the yes. aroma. The aroma speaks for is itself. is amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and just, I'm, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get it, yeah. This ice cream brandy, I have mm -hmm. never tried anything like this. I have the crunch from the coating, and then as soon as I go into that bad boy, the ice cream, the chocolate ice cream comes spewing out. But you know what, I feel like, I honestly feel like, this dessert is a perfect end to a perfect day. I agree. So we made it back to the front and it was such an amazing experience. I personally learned so much, like how to make fresh guacamole. Make sure you like and subscribe and let us know what you would like for us to review in the comments. Chef's kiss. Ah. Thank you.